Welcome Why back. People standing for me during Black History Month is amazing. <laughs> Thank you. You got people standing for you all the time. You are kicking ass, Phoebe Robinson. Congratulations on everything that you're doing. Has it felt like a whirlwind for you? I mean, I know that you 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 were genuinely grinding for a long time as a as a comedian, as a writer, and then it felt like everything just clicked. You went two dope queens. Two dope queens went from a podcast into a TV show. Now you're in a movie. Yeah. Are, are you soaking it all in? I am. It feels very exciting. I am on ShopBop all the time getting discount sweaters. I'm feeling <laughs> really good. <laughs> I made it, you guys! Like, I, no, I'm excited. I, I don't know about that. Your fashion has been one of the things people comment on most <gasps> on Two Dope Queens. They go, like, every... Do you plan that as, like, do you go, like, this is going to be the fashion for this show or is that just a byproduct of your style? Or yeah, I like have a... like a whole glam team. Katya Sussman is my stylist. Delina does my hair. Sabrina, sorry, Delina does my makeup. Sabrina does my hair. And we just like, we want to knock it out the park. Right. We look to like Tracy Ellis Ross and Solange and all these amazing queens. And I just want to be on that level, you know? This is what, I, what I've always loved about Two Dope Queens mm -hmm. is that it, it really covers everything. It's not afraid to be funny. It's not afraid to be angry. It's not afraid to be sad and, and, and happy and joyful and optimistic at the same time. It's not afraid to be black, but it's not afraid to be not stereotypically black. Mm -hmm. What do you enjoy most about being on the show and what are, you, what are you excited about in this new season? I think Jess and I, when we met, we were both kind of like, we do improv, we sometimes we date white dudes. Sorry, guys. Um, <laughs> and we just, we want to be ourselves. And so we will, you know, we love waiting to exhale, but we also love like Harry Potter. So it's like this right. nice, Perfect mix. I think that's like a great mix. And so we just have fun. And I think people really respond to that. You also on you've got a stand-up tour coming out. Yes. And I love it. It's called Sorry Harriet Tubman. Yes. <laughs> because I'm ignorant. Like I really am like, <laughs> I'm like, Harriet worked so hard on that railroad, and here I come making like dick jokes. So sorry, Harriet. I'm so sorry, girl. You say that, but you're one of the <laughs> smartest people I know, though. I Thank feel like you. that's the game that you play, though, right? Yeah. You, you like mask your smarts in the dick jokes. Uh, of course, because you want people to feel like at ease and then you right. hit them. You're like, and they're like, oh, well, knowledge. So it feels good. <laughs> it's very interesting how, I guess, men and women do it different, because you, your technique is I whip out the dicks and then people get calm, yeah. and then I come with the knowledge, and yeah. I'm like, no, I go with the knowledge and then I'll whip out the dick. Yeah, I feel she... like it's a, it's a different game that we'd be playing. Yes. <laughs> very different techniques that we have. Um, the movies. Yes. Are you enjoying that? I am enjoying It's fun to kind of be on a set, and this was the biggest movie I've ever done, What Men Want. Like, Taraji right. was awesome. And I just was like, I kept to myself. I, like, didn't want to break the thing. So I was just, like, sweating out, like, my all-natural deodorant. I was like, I definitely can't talk to her now because I stink. But I, like, had... I was so excited to be a part of the Do you movie. wish you, you could read men's minds? I wish I could read my boyfriend's mind. All the time? Not all the time, but he'll just be... I'll be like, what are you thinking? He's like, nothing. I'm like, there's nothing happening in your head at all right now? Yes, yes, there is and nothing happening wild. in his head. wild. <laughs> that's what you... The, he, men are not lying when they say there's absolutely nothing How? happening. How? I'll be, like, going along my day, and then I'll remember, like, in eighth grade when I tripped in front of my crush, and that, like, ruins a good hour of my life. Like, I'm like, oh, shit, Why I gotta go back there. Why are you torturing yourself? <laughs> uh, before I let you go... Yes. You are you are going to be going to uh, Africa, to Kenya specifically, yes. in the coming months. Yes. What is that for, and why is that so big for you? Um, well, I have teamed up with Red and one organizations that were co-founded by Bono, and I'm obsessed with YouTube. But I really have been, and I've been like involved in charity for a while, and I really like what they do. And right. so I've been really stateside, sort of talking about like how they raise money, how they're you know trying to get all the drugs over to Africa. So I really wanted to be on the ground and see like where that money's going, so I could like speak about it in a more, like, intelligent way, like, full way. Right. Um, so I'm really excited. I'm going with a bunch of donors, and I don't know what to expect. Have you been before? I've never been. So never I'm, been to Kenya or never been to I've Africa? I've never been to Africa, so oh, I'm really wow. excited. I feel like I'm going to cry, like an Oprah oh, yeah, cry. Like, I'm going to do all the things. You must... You, you need to kiss the ground when you get there. Okay. You need to kiss the ground, and yeah. then you must Wakanda to everyone that you meet. <laughs> Just, that's all you do. Yeah. Just everywhere you go, just be like Wakanda forever. Yeah. And everyone's gonna be like, yeah, 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 that's, that's, that's how we roll. I'm excited for you. Yeah, that's gonna be fun. Thank you so much. Take lots of pictures and then come back and tell us about yes, it when you come absolutely. back. absolutely. This is so much fun. Two Dope Queens airs Fridays at 11 on HBO. The stand-up tour, Sorry Harriet Tubman, begins in March. Phoebe Robinson, everybody. <laughs>